Can't have you getting fat. Good morning, babe. Are we filming? Yeah. Oh. There you go, Snort. Come here, Toot. That a boy. You guys aren't used to getting fed right here, huh? Snort. There you go, Snort. Toot. Say hello. Say good morning, boys. Hi, guys. Morning. morning. Snort. This one's Snort. This one's Toot. See, he's got longer tusks on the side of his mouth there. Snort, we had to have his tusks trimmed back because they were getting kind of hung up. Okay. All, All right. right. That's All right, boys. Next, boys. Go for your walk. Go get some exercise. Work off them bones. <laughs> okay. <laughs> so we are rolling, right? Yep. All right. Coffee and questions. Enough of the feeding time. You get the, the pig snout juice off my hands. <laughs> All right. So we have a question from uh, Jack Durney. Oh, oh, excuse me. Yeah, Durney. Eric, in one of your videos, you said paint was hard to get off because it penetrated the wood. Now that you're using the primer, my question is, do you sand and seal before the primer to keep it from penetrating in the wood? Love the coffee break videos. Thanks, Jack. I appreciate that. Okay, so here's the deal, guys. This is the sanding sealer that I use. Now, you've also seen me use Deft brand. Um, uh, either one of them work. They both work about the same for me. Uh, sometimes I brush it on. I, if I can find the spray cans, I'll spray it on. Um, but the main thing is, always use the sanding sealer before you spray your board black with anything. Uh, whether it's ink, paint, whatever it is. Now that's only, only if you're using, or th this is my suggestions, only if you're using pine. If I'm using cedar, redwood, western red cedar, uh, anything other than pine, I never have a problem with the ink or the paint bleeding into the, the grain. So only if you're using pine. Now, the panel board that I use, this is a piece of that panel board, this is pine as well. So I use the sanding sealer on this and uh, the regular select pine. Uh, but again, guys, remember, why are we using the sanding sealer? We're using the sanding sealer so the ink or the, the black won't soak into the board when you're doing your layout or you're after your carving when you're putting your black on there. So you have to put the sanding sealer on before anything else. I suggest as soon as you get it back to your, your shop, uh, get that sanding sealer on there and then put it up in the rack for you know future signs. That's when you need to put your sanding sealer on. You don't put your sanding sealer on after you've done your carving because that's when you actually want the ink or the paint to actually go into your carving and stay there okay so sanding sealer goes on first before anything else so I'm hoping this kind of clears that up um, yeah that's uh, that was basically the extent of the question yeah yeah either sanding sealer or paint put this uh, or uh, paint or ink put the sanding sealer on as soon as you get your boards uh, home back to your shop okay all right guys Make it a great day out there. Make some sawdust. Sawdust equals happiness. Sure. And please, uh, share our videos. Um, uh, please share our videos. We really appreciate if you would do that. We, we put a lot of work into these, and, and all we're asking is that you, uh, you share our videos as much as you can and get the word out. So everybody, make it a great day. We'll see you on the next one. Bye-bye.